October is Domestic Violence Awareness Month. It began back in 1981 to help connect victims to safety planning and domestic violence programs, all key measures that can mean the difference between a life or death situation. Brenda Water shows us what to watch out for in our loved ones. Who walking among us is in an abusive relationship? Four women every day are killed by a partner. We see victims and survivors who are women, who are men, um, and you know anybody can be a, a victim or survivor of intimate partner violence. Domestic violence, also known as intimate partner violence, has no boundaries. This pattern of power and control over another person within a relationship doesn't care about socioeconomic or ethnic boundaries nor gender, but there is a group with a higher risk of not surviving. That said, um, African American women are at higher risk for being killed within relationships. Nicole Molinero of the Women's Center and Shelter of Greater Pittsburgh says no one really knows why that figure is higher. But the best safety net for any victim is safety planning and connecting to a domestic violence program. Unfortunately, only 4% of victims killed were connected to some sort of program. Women's Center and Shelter of Greater Pittsburgh offers a comprehensive range of services, so it really doesn't matter if you are just trying to determine whether you're in an abusive relationship or whether you're fleeing for your life. We have a service to meet you where you are and help you determine what your goal is and then meet that goal. The numbers don't lie. One out of every four relationships is chronically violent. One out of every three women and one out of every seven men have experienced sex abuse, sex violence, or intimate partner violence. Shelters say whenever a story is done about domestic abuse awareness, their hotlines light up. If you need help, find more information at kdka.com. Brenda Waters, KDKA News.